Okay, so we're going to go ahead and solve a truss here in MD Solid. So if you noticed, I clicked on Solids from the main screen. I clicked New Truss. I tend to do a spacing of one just because a lot of times, you know, you want to do one of something. And the number of spaces, I, 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 I use that as my increments, right? So I get a good grid that is easy to draw on because it's every, every line is an increment of one. Um, but if that doesn't work for you, you know, if you're doing something bigger, you might have to change that. Okay, so now to draw, you basically select members and create. Let's say I want to click, drag, and let up on the mouse. That's a member. If I want to erase, I do the same thing. Let's say I have two members. Um, it's not going to let me erase both at the same time. I have to click from one point to the next, let up. Click from one point and drag to the next, let up. And that will erase a member. So let's go ahead and take create two members. Create a couple of more members here. Okay, so we have our truss. Then we're going to go ahead and click on some supports. Now, to create a support for a roller support, you just click and drag in the direction you want the support. For a pin support, you click and drag perpendicular to the direction you want the support. And then add a second line that is parallel to the direction you want support and that will create a pin roller. It's like you're putting in the two forces that it's going to give you. Finally, with loads, you just click on the place that you want the load, you drag down, and you provide a magnitude for the load. <clears throat> okay, you can put the load. Uh, notice that when I try to put a load somewhere other than on a support, it's not going to work. Okay. Okay, so we have our loads here, and then when I'm ready to go, have all the loads, I click on Compute, and there we have it. Okay, so that is our, um, it basically it solves a trust for, for us. If we want just a list, we can do these uh, the member forces, it tells us going to touch and our compression. We can do the reaction forces as well. We can also do copy to clipboard. Um, we can do... Um, save bitmap as, we can do print, and we can also get a, uh, a um, set of the forces, right? Okay. All right, uh, so that is how we do trusses in MD solids. Good luck.